Hi, my name is Carol Weston, and I write books for young people. You might know some of the characters in my novels, like Ava and Pip, and Melanie Martin, and Sophia in Speed of Life. Today, I want to talk to you about Ava Wren. She's the main character in Ava and Pip, Ava and Taco Cat, and Ava XOX. Tell us about your character. Ava is a fifth grader who loves words, especially words that are spelled the same forwards and backwards. Words like Ava, and Mom, and Dad, and Sis, and Huh, and Wow, W-O-W. -W. These words are called palindromes. Kayak and race car are also palindromes, and so is Taco Cat. There are even palindromes in Spanish, like La Ruta Natural. In some ways, Ava is like me because I'm a word nerd. I always kept diaries and I was the youngest member of my family. Like Ava, I also sometimes felt overlooked because my older sibling got more attention from my mom. What I love about Ava is that she is scrappy and good-hearted and impulsive. It's hard for her that her sister is painfully shy, so Ava works to help Pip find her voice. And in doing so, she finds her own. Another character in the series is B. B wants to be an advice columnist when she grows up. And guess what? I am an advice columnist. I've been Dear Carol at Girls Life magazine since its first issue. Yes, for 25 years, girls have been writing me questions and I've been offering answers. Taco Cat is also a fun character. He's a rescue cat and at first, all he wants to do is hide. Ava writes a story called The Cat Who Wouldn't Purr. Taco Cat finally does start purring, but there's trouble when Ava's story gets published with the photo of the cat. Don't worry, there's a happy ending. After all, it's a kid's book. Three more characters are Maybell, a best friend who is great at math, Chuck, who is not Ava's boyfriend, but who is definitely her best guy friend, and Tanya, who gets bullied because of her appearance. What made you want to become a creator of books? You know what's fun? when a book comes out in different languages. My first book, Girl Talk, All the Stuff Your Sister Never Told You, was translated into 12 languages. I'm a linguist, so I thought that was excellent. But wanna know how you say excellent in French and Spanish and Italian? Excellent, excelente, excelente. Pretty similar, right? See, I told you I'm a word nerd. I hope you keep reading and keep writing. If you found a whale in your bathtub, what would you do? I'd shut the door and run.